Ken Surfs here, and another shave. Middle of the week, Wednesday. Got out a little early. What is it? It's about uh, 3.25. Uh, got to uh, go to the dentist today and have him clean the teeth. Ouch, you know. But uh, get a chance to try out some new products. I uh, had a mail call today uh, from West Coast Shaving. And they have just came out with a new line of brass handles, solid brass handles. For their razors. And uh, they have quite a few uh, to choose from. I had a hard time picking out one that uh, I wanted to try. So I ended up picking this one out. And man, solid brass heavy as can be, and actually uh, it's got a matte finish, a really nice handle. So I'm pairing it up today with uh, one of the West Coast Shavings closed comb chrome heads. So let's open that up. And this is the, uh, the closed uh, comb West Coast Shaving Head. And uh, Look at that, two-tone, two-tone, very nice. Man, that's a nice long handle too. Looks like it's almost, almost as long as my uh, Black Beauty. So very nice long handle. In fact, does it fit into my Black Beauty stand? I might have to, oh, a little bit off. Let's see. Might have to see my buddy about getting some more of these stands. I know he's got a few, there we go. I know he's got a few left. So uh, it will be nice on the display here. I'll have the, the chrome and I'll have the, uh, well, let me show you what it looks like. You'll see what my, uh, my display looks like. Hang on. All right, pause. there's the display. So it does kind of offset it. We've got a couple of uh, chrome handles. We've got it and we've got a couple of black handles. So uh, it's kind of nice to have that little display going. And oops, there's my son's razor. He won't use one of these anymore. All right. So I'm going to get that set up to start. And uh, I kind of nicked myself on the neck a couple of times the other day. So uh, I will be using some uh, prep pre-shave today just to uh, make sure. I am going to be using, I have it right out here some uh, Victory Shaving Company Flight Engineer and this is the uh, bamboo ginger and coconut scent so uh, yeah it smells real nice I'm gonna use this I believe this might be the first time for this one and uh, uh, I feel like some uh, rum runner I kind of like that also from uh, West Coast Shaving and uh, I guess I, uh, I still be using the Humphreys today. So we've got uh, quite a few things and it's a little quieter now. I'm not caffeinated and uh, we're not in a hurry to do anything. So we can get this thing started. In fact, oh, last but not least, soaking in the crystal skull, the Violong or Violong horsehair brush. Now I think what I might do today is I might yeah, I'll use the uh, a Captain's Choice bowl to whip that soap up. So I'm going to put a little of the soap right into here. It usually works right out of the uh, the tin that it comes in, but uh, I'm using that horse hair, so, and it's been a while. And of course I use my British 50 pence piece because of that nice square end, and it just nicely squares enough of that off. It should go right into the bowl. There we go. I kept that as change when I came back from England 1996 vacation. So very cool. All right. Let us put that down. Start whipping that soap up. So has your week been going good? We're halfway through. It's a short week for me, as I mentioned. Oh man, nice. Soap all with Soap smells good and always, always does good. 
Oh, I almost forgot. I better load that razor real quick. And I'm going to use a uh, Dorco Prime. Somebody was asking, uh, I haven't used these in a little while, and uh, I do enjoy them. So I'm going to use a Dorco Prime blade today in this razor. See, I usually have all of this prepared, but then I cut scenes and it shortens the video. You can always fast forward through it. Let me load this thing. You can always fast forward through it if you want to. All right. Load that guy up right there. Now we're ready. So let's get back to that, uh, that soap there. Yeah, it's weird seeing, uh, what is it? It's Gillette Vector. I thought I saved the box of my son's, but he's using, uh, he's using this razor now off the shelf. Uh, he picked that up. And the reason being, it's about four months ago, he was going for a job interview and he, uh, I wasn't home. He asked my wife, he said, uh, what would be a good razor? Uh, I want to borrow one of dad's razors. And uh, she asked him, you know, do you know how to set it up? Oh, yeah, yeah, I know how to set it up. And she goes, well, his blades are in the drawer and uh, the razors are on display. So he grabbed the Mula R41 <laughs> and a feather blade. And he used water with no shave cream. I came home. I thought, uh, <laughs> I thought there'd been a murder in my bathroom. There was blood everywhere. He had cut the hell out of his neck, cut the hell out of his face, uh, more nicks than I care to imagine. And, uh, he said he would never use a safety razor again. I said, well, you know, some common sense would have said, uh, you should have asked me and I would not have recommended the Mula R41 with a feather blade in it and no shave soap just usually wets his skin, you know, and shaves. So now he's using that, uh, that Gillette. Hey, serves him right. Soap down, that bowl down. One thing though that's nice and uh, crisp edges on that blade or that handle. And uh, the handles fit, you know, whatever razor head you have. Nice. I kind of like the two-tone look. I tell you, West Coast Shaving is uh, really evolving with their own products. And I haven't actually went to the brick and mortar store lately. It's been about a year. I should go up pay a visit again. Congrats again to the two gentlemen in my giveaway. I heard from one of them, the, the first winner. Uh, but I did not hear from the second guy yet. So uh, get back to me. I've got your stuff ready to go. In fact, I'll be shipping out the first uh, crystal skull when I'm done with this. Nice. I didn't draw blood. Nice. And somebody had asked, why do you use pre-shave? And uh, that's why if I have a, you know, I want to add a little extra slickness. So I've maybe had a cut or something. It certainly doesn't hurt.
is that doggone automatic air freshener again. And Halloween's coming up. So uh, those Crystal Skull uh, I hear are showing up on the uh, uh, home goods shelves and uh, on eBay a lot more frequent now because uh, that's the season for them. All right, pass two. Yeah, that's nice and heavy. Nice balance. Still no cut. Nice. I'll tell you one thing though, I'm not going to do a third pass on my neck because uh, so far I've spared myself. I just, you know, don't want to risk it. This took a few days for that to heal. But I will do a third pass on the face. Cold water wash, rinse. Very nice. I'm gonna do three steps, in fact. We'll use this first. And this is totally overkill. I got a nice neutral scent. Totally overkill, but I, my face still feels like it's healing some, so I'm going to use some uh, Nivea Sensitive. I wasn't going to do it, but when I, I could feel myself and see, no blood, but uh, I'll put a little Nivea Sensitive on there. Seventeen Rum Runner. Oh, yeah, Whew. that's a burn. I wonder if my kid used aftershave after shaving with that mula and the feather. <laughs> Ten bucks says he didn't. I don't know. Oh, man. Ten bucks says he didn't. All right. Well, man, there's been a few things that I haven't tried in a while, and uh, the Primes, no hassle with that, you know. I did hear that the older, uh, the older Dorco blades, in fact, I thought I had some. I think these are the older ones, and uh, I heard these ones weren't so good. So uh, I, I've got a pack, but uh, I haven't really tried them. So. Uh, taking your advice if they say they, they cut you they're definitely gonna cut me but the new the prime whew, you know no trouble at all and that razor very nice and it does look good on display I get to rotate the crop there 
And like I said, my friend George who makes these, I think he uh, made 20 and I think he's got four left. So uh, I've got his email in here if you're interested. You can you can talk to him, but uh, it's kind of nice to have them all on display and it uh, helps, you know, helps them drip dry. All right, uh, another uh, successful shave, midweek shave. And uh, hopefully we're gonna get a few more out than we have been in the last month. It's been a lot going on, but now things are settling down again. So that's great. So again, thank you very much for watching. Thank you for your subscriptions. And uh, Richie Rich or Ricky Rich, get back to me with your address, buddy, and uh, I'll get that out to you. All right. And uh, the other winner, it's, it's heading out today. All right. Till next time, it's Ken Surf saying have a great night.